I talk to Christians and non-Christians alike. They, they look at God as a, as a hateful, resentful, heavy-handed, mean-spirited, close-fisted, uh, tyrannical God. And can I just assure you this morning that while God does judge sin, God has a whole lot more attribute to him than just judgment and just righteousness. He has eternal love. In John 13, 1, it says that having loved his own which were in the world, he loved them unto the end. You see, knowing the eternal love of God changes our view of how he answers prayer. In Ephesians 2, 4, but God who is rich in mercy for his great love wherewith he loved us. Now, there are some really great things about God. Can I say that this morning? There are some really great things. But one of the greatest of all is love. He has a limitless, eternal, and great love for his people. Hereby perceive we the love of God. This is how we perceive the love of God. Because he laid down his life for us, and we ought to lay down our lives for the brethren. He laid his life down for us, and that's how we perceive God's love. I'm so thankful that he loves me. You hear people all the time and they say, I struggle with praying. So here they are, they struggle with praying. And I say, well, what's your view of God? And boy, that answers a lot of questions when they tell me their view of God.